1958 was another game that was, again, terribly exciting. 10 to 7, the final score. Um, really, when you look at the history of college football, the coaches involved in that, we're talking about Len Casanova and Woody Hayes. You, in, in college football realm, you don't get names much bigger than that. And uh, they went, again, they, they went head to head in the Rose Bowl. And, and we're talking about Ohio State, so that should have a certain amount of resonance for this, uh, for everyone for this year. And uh, again, it, it was a, a field goal. We had a field goal go wide left. It got hooked left uh, in the third quarter when we were down by three points that would have, uh, that would have tied us. And then in the uh, final in the fourth quarter, there were, uh, we uh, had to turn the ball over on downs as we were driving towards the end zone. So again, you know, close. Close, but on the on the wrong side of close. <laughs> but both of them are, and all three of those games, I think, are really exciting for people to look back at and to see and to also remember. You know, because I think a lot of times, because there was a time in Oregon football where it, uh, you know, not many people followed it and not many people were involved in it as they are today. But I think it's important for people to look back and to see our long history and the pride that the university took in its football team and sort of the, the early strides we took historically for establishing college football in the western part of the country.